Hi Taurus and welcome to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. Thank you so much for all your support so far, for all your likes, comments and subscribes and donations. I really appreciate them. If you're new here, welcome. So your October video was the third most popular, hence this bonus reading today. So I'm going to do a love reading because we got a soulmate energy that came through for you. So let's do your energy, their energy. Okay. Could be a Leo, Aries Leo, Sagittarius on your mind. You definitely think about what you want at the moment. You might be dreaming about this person. Could be a also, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces coming through. Air, um, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. There's someone you want to communicate with. Or you, you'd love for them to come in and communicate with you. Wow, they came out really quickly, so there's a strong message here for you, Taurus. Yes, okay, well we got two tens, so some of you might have been through quite a difficult ending recently, or even a bit longer ago, quite a painful ending, it was quite a burden on you. Could have been the end of, um, you know, a relationship. All this is to come. Yeah, your wishes, as I said, this is what I was getting, is maybe to reach out to someone or for them to come in towards you. Someone in your mind could be an age gap. They could be at a distance from you. I feel that this cycle of pain and hurt and heartbreak is, is going to come to an end if that's what you've been through. You know, I really get that with these two. Quite a lot of pain in your past. There might have been a third party involved if you were with someone. And you're putting an end to that chapter. Yeah, you might be... A little bit up and down with your emotions at the moment. You'd love to communicate and move on. Um, communicate with someone, as I said, there's someone on your mind. At the moment you also might be having some quite harsh communication with someone and then you just want to move on from this situation you've maybe been in. Could be a cancer on your mind. It feels like this heaviness is lifting though, so that's positive. And um, we've got Scorpio, Aquarius, Leo, Taurus, and Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces coming through. Let's see now, okay, this person on your mind's energy, okay, it could be a Virgo or Scorpio. There's definitely your energy coming through in their mind. They're quite anxious at the moment, they're not sleeping well. They're moving on as well, is what I'm feeling, from something. Okay, wow, Taurus, this is pretty special. Um, those of you who feel you're in a twin flame connection, this is definitely for you because we've got lots of indicators here of that. We've got Four of Wands, High Priestess, Emperor. So a very strong spiritual connection. Aries, Pisces, but it's more about the connection. So they have this on their mind at the moment, yeah, they really want to come back in. So those of you that are waiting for someone, they do want that. They want to reunite with you. 
um, they know what they want as well and they might be purging a lot at the moment so that's why you're not hearing from them so I'm feeling they've been through something as well they know that this is meant to be with you and um, also six of cups at the bottom so you know someone they're thinking about someone from their past so this is potentially someone you've already met they're really reflecting a lot but they're feeling stuck in their current situation I do feel they might be you know in a commitment at the moment there might have been someone else involved and that's why they're having to heal you know definitely with these two there's an element of leveling up knowing what they want so if they didn't in the past okay Aries Leo Sagittarius Aquarius yes now they also flip the energies by the way this could be yours this could be theirs I, I feel that both of you have been through something painful in the past now you might have ended or they might have ended things with you quite abruptly in the past is what I'm getting and it's been a burden on you because twin flame connections often are they're very they feel heavy because you've got a lot of purging to do I feel that this is your twin flame who is going to come back in very spiritual connection they have an inner knowing now they might not have in the past and I feel that you've like always known it's been very heavy on you yeah a lot of purging for both of you but you're at different stages in the like ascension and purging stage let's see what's to come for you what could come for you Taurus okay wow now when we get a repeat card that is always amazing so this Aries Leo Sagittarius here that's their energy is coming back in things are going to be more balanced between you both okay yeah I definitely feel that you've been very lonely and they might have ghosted you in the past you've been healing purging and waiting for this person yeah let's see what's potentially to come for this person Okay, wow Taurus, this is amazing because this is definitely confirming someone from their past is returning to them and we've got your energy, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo could be an age gap between you both um, now maybe you're going to reach out to them with a little offer if not, I feel they are with you they are going to go through an awakening definitely and there's the reconciliation as well they're moving on yeah wow they're moving on to their queen of wands the one that they know is for them that's amazing strong twin flame here they're being called to you this is like the calling Okay, let's get a Romance Angel for you, Taurus. Okay, keep an open mind in this situation. Something a bit different about this person, maybe. You might be a bit unsure. For them, they got new love. And I feel this is, you know, because we've got someone from the past, this is rekindling and starting something new. So 
not necessarily a new person. Well, and for both of you, very soon. So, you know, it's really, it really, I really feel your energies are coming together in this, in this reading. Um, decide what you want because it's going to come in very soon. Okay, let's see if we can get a message from this person to you. Oh, there it is. So we've got miracles and blessings. So they're telling you this miracle might not seem like it's going to happen, but this miracle is going to happen, this blessing, which is this connection. So they're going through a change. What would you like to say to them? Slow down, yeah. So you know that, you know, they have you in their mind, but they've got a lot of stuff, a lot of confusion, a lot of stuff to go through first. That they they need to, also they need to just let go of control, maybe. Control issues. With the two flames, you know, really getting to inflame here. As I said before. Okay, one for both of you, listen with your heart. Yeah, you've got that inner knowing, so have they, with that High Priestess. Use your intuition. And the number one, there's that new beginning, I feel. Okay. The nine for spiritual change, yes. Okay, Taurus, so I hope you've enjoyed this reading. Please let me know if it resonates. Um, I'd love to hear from some more of you. If you'd like a personal reading, please check the description box below for more info. Wishing you peace, love and light on your journeys and see you next time.